National winner Belgium Old Birds, Verger de Nolf, Jab. The national winner Belgium from Perpignan, International, 2022 in the category Old Birds is Verger de Nolf, Jab. The pigeon was clocked on Sunday at 8.39 Central European Summer Time after a race of 953.264 km, achieving an average velocity of 897.78 m per minute. The duo Vergerd, Denalf is a husband-wife combination who both earn a living in the care sector. This means early, late, night, and weekend shifts. Seeing that this gives inconveniences on a weekly basis during the racing season, the couple has opted to only race the international races, and this is with the classic nest game. Both the cocks and the hens are basket. They had won the first provincial from Ruffick in 97, the first and second provincial from Nantes in 2003 and the victory from Sustens is consequently their third provincial triumph. Each time one when it is sweltering, they add. Their pigeon colony is built up with the old sort from Dieschacht and Wyver from Westkirk, supplemented with pigeons from Gel Jalima and from Franz van Pepperstraten, both from the Netherlands and from Herman van Belligum from Snelligem. They only have two breeding couples and every year 30 youngsters are ringed. Our aim is to stand by the top 100 national a few times every year, says the duo Vergert, Denolf. Let us say that up until now, as fanciers with the small basket and with only a small number of pigeons, they have been 100% successful in their aim. They form the model example of successful long-distance racing with only a small number of pigeons and then via the nest game. Extreme long distance is raced with cocks and hens in a nest. To this end, Kurt has devised a very special system in which only one thing is of particular importance, motivation and reward. First of all, the objective is to shine on the entire international calendar. The Barcelona race is not an end, this is only one of the seven international classics. The pigeons are central. We are both passionate about pigeons and we go for the full 100% to achieve great results in the international game. We both work in the healthcare sector with the associated shift and weekend work. Because we want to test both cocks and hens, everything is raced on a nest here. One of the additional advantages of this is that you can ring a full season of youngsters from the better pigeons. A disadvantage, on the other hand, is that you can only race the pigeons twice a year in an ideal position. Usually, cock and hen from the same couple are basket together. After the season, Perpignan, the pigeons are separated and this continues until about March 5th, then the first group is coupled and 14 days later the second group is coupled. They may then all raise one round of youngsters. This two-week difference is only there to be able to move something extra from the best pigeons. They are assigned during this period. This goes from two times just before Wevelgem, approximately 42 kilometers, over Muskran, approximately 46 kilometers, Templov, approximately 61 kilometers, to Parovals. Some pigeons then fly from Eris, approximately 100 kilometers, and for others a race from Clermont, approximately 206 kilometers, is the start. This is followed by a training race from Clermont and Fontenay, approximately 330 kilometers, on their first nest. The pigeons are separated again and the weeks before basketing from Bourges they are on widowhood. Because all internationals are raced on a nest, the weeks for Bourges are very important, a matter of getting the best possible basic condition because once they have returned from the race from Bourges, everything is coupled in function of the international races on the calendar. On Pau and Agen most pigeons are basket between 8 and 15 days, for Barcelona this is with a small youngster. Later in the season it is sometimes a bit of searching and improvising, partly due to possible latecomers and stragglers, to basket them back in an ideal position, preferably with a small youngster. After Bourges, there was even one more preparation flight from Arlon. They were liberated together and although they are liberated in groups, most pigeons come home individually they have certainly had to search well and eventually learned a lot. After this, they are ready for their first international assignment. During the winter period, the couples are already planning on which flights they will be deployed. In winter, the racing pigeons go out here alternately every day. The cocks one day and the hens the next. 
once they are coupled for a first round, they fly out every day. To prevent our pigeons from migrating to the surrounding fields, candy is occasionally sprinkled on the lawn in front of the lofts. The pigeons receive breeding from vanrabes and buyers for the entire season. During the molting period, this is of course a molting mixture. The training in the racing season is initially done with the flag, but after a while, this is no longer necessary. In the morning and if necessary, in the evening the nest pigeons, cocks, fly out together with the youngsters and in the afternoon the hens have free training. The national winner Perpigna came home this year close to the Belgian coast in Jab in the loft of Kurt Vergard and Anya de Nolf. Kurt, I had worked five nights, as a nurse, and was sleeping. I had asked Anya to wake me up if we had an early one, and she did so very enthusiastically. Actually, I had hoped that it was my first nominated, this one won 74th national, but of course I was also very happy with this one, second nominated. Anya, I told him, it is not the first sign, but she is very early. Very unfortunate for Kurt, but for me the arrival was very special. She also dived straight onto the shelf and in, but our pigeons normally always do that. Kurt, one that stays put makes a difference, it hurts somewhere. Kurt and Anya are specialists in the toughest work, a conscious choice. Kurt, we don't have the time to focus on all disciplines, that's why we chose to specialize. This game suits us best. Moreover, with our location here in a remote corner of the country, I think we have the best chances of winning in this discipline. Anya, and winning is what we do it for, you put a lot of time and energy into it, and you still want to see results.